information for the Commodore, an urgent matter. Please, no one comments Carry on. how he plucked a man and a woman. Lots of sour blood between them two, Rogers and Chamberlain. What's the issue? The Commodore don't think much of the There's a rumor going on that Rogers is some kind of Jacobite, or worse, that he's a Catholic. <laughs> I could do the worst. Gather those two men there.
governor's given us a pardon, Commodore. Don't a man's word mean anything in these times? A syphilis clouded your mind. Why scratch and claw to protect such squalor? Your parasites feeding off the industry of honest men. Much like King George in that respect. Know your place, peasant! You may have taken my life, but you have not improved your own by any measure. Does some purpose keep you talking? <sighs> if not for that heathen, Governor Rogers, I'd have seen you hanged from your own cross trees. Worm. All of you. Commodore's dead. Are we ready? We're close. We've got a problem with the galleon. There's a couple of dozen. Bloody hell. You raise a cloud here, lout. You sat on enough gunpowder to blow New Providence off its rocks. Lay off me, mate. I'm, I'm well chafed. As I was telling, a squad of lobsters has commandeered our galleon. We're going to have to clear it out before we use them cannons to blow the brocade. Captain, keep it afloat. Our force patrol these waters closely, Captain. Loose all and trim out to the wind. The Brits are on to us. Look there. Captain, not a 
Mighty mess there. <laughs> Burn your bastards! Yeah! The burning of your ass, governor! Prancing about like they took a prize. Kid, you missed quite a time. Aye. Pity about Nassau and Blackbeard flying the coop. Well, we'll see about Thatch. Oh. Vane's off to see him now, and I'm following soon. This is what's left of your experiment in democracy. Aye. We do as we please here, and we take our time doing it. For Christ's sake, Edward. Don't anything but the stink of riches wrinkle your nose. What's got into you, man? 
Reality, mate. Reality. See that you ain't pulled into the drink by this drowning rat. Oi. I've lived longer than most men who trod this path.
Disappointment you are, Thatch. His mind's made up to stay, he says. It's a soddy. And hang all of you lot that follow this sorry bastard into obscurity. Faith in me is kind. But with Nassau done in me, I feel I'm finished. I'm not of the same mind, mate. But I won't begrudge you the state of yours. You still looking for that sage fellow? Aye. Taking a prize a month back, I heard a man named Roberts was working a slave ship called the Princess. I want to see about it. The princess. Cheers, Thatch. Well, don't sit there like a barrel of wet fish. We're celebrating my retirement! <laughs> I'd caught this man's breakfast! Save us a few bottles, eh? 